In 2015, a wealthy couple, Richard and Nancy Oland, were at their family-owned business when Richard was brutally murdered. Richard Oland was the scion of a prominent Canadian beer-making family, and his murder quickly became a high-profile case. The investigation into Richard's death was complicated by the fact that he had been bludgeoned to death with a weapon that was never found. However, investigators were able to use forensic evidence to determine that the killer had worn gloves and that Richard's blood had been found on his son's clothing. Richard's son, Dennis Oland, was eventually charged and tried for his father's murder. The prosecution's case rested largely on circumstantial evidence, including Dennis's financial problems and his strained relationship with his father. Despite a lack of direct evidence linking Dennis to the murder, he was found guilty in 2015 and sentenced to life in prison. However, in 2016, the verdict was overturned on appeal due to errors in the judge's instructions to the jury, 